Hello everyone, it's the Bath and Beauty Freak and I'm here today to show you my CVS haul for the week. This will be my second transaction for the week. I was going to get all these items Sunday, but I forgot to print off my 30% off coupon. Anyway, what I got, I received a 30% off beauty coupon in my email. So, that's what I used on this transaction and I'll show you what I got. The first things I picked up was the Jergens Wet Skin Moisturizer. These are regular price at my store, $7.99. And Jergens is part of a spend 10 get 5 back this week um, in extra care bucks. So two of them at $7.99 equals $15.98. And I had a 3 off of 10 lotion coupon, which printed from the red box. And then I had the 30% off, which took off $3.89. And I also had two $2 off manufacturer coupons, which came from the inserts, Sunday inserts. I'm not sure which week. Um, but that brought the total down to five dollars and nine cents for the two, and I got five back, so that was nine cents for those. That's a great deal because you know that's sixteen dollars worth of product for nine cents. Can't beat that. Um, the next thing I got was the Physician's Formula. Physician's Formula is spend fourteen get ten back this week in extra care bucks. Um, I did have a coupon print at the Red Box this week for seven off of a twenty-two dollar Physician's Formula purchase, so I wanted to take advantage of that. So this is what I got. I got the um, Touch of Blur Nude Wear, um, which was thirteen twenty nine, and then I got this mascara, um, the Organic Wear Work It Full Flared Fit mascara for nine ninety nine. So both those items equaled twenty three dollars and twenty eight cents. You take off the seven dollar off of twenty two CVS manufacturer, not manufacturer CVS Redbox coupon, and then the thirty percent came off, which took off four dollars and eighty eight cents. That brings the total to eleven forty for the two items and ten get ten back in extra care bucks, which I, I did get that. So um, that makes it a dollar forty. So that's what like a seventy cents a piece. Awesome deal on that. And um, I was gonna leave it at just getting this because all I needed to spend um, on my receipt, I needed to spend nine dollars and seventy five cents more toward the beauty club to get um, five back in extra care bucks. But um, I, I saw this on the Halloween aisle and I just couldn't pass it up. Um, they had several different designs, Halloween designs, but these are the Impress, um, Impress on Manicure Nails. I do like these, um, and I've used them before, just not these designs. Um, but these are limited edition, so if you're looking for some uh, nails, they these weren't, in my store, they were not with the nails. They were with the Halloween decorations. Um, but these are $7.99, and uh, my 30% off coupon also applied to this, so that brought it, took $2.40 off, so... It made those five fifty nine, and I didn't have any other coupons or anything. I just wanted to get these. I thought they were really cool looking. So um, that's everything that I got on this receipt. All the coupons that I already mentioned. Um, my thirty percent off took off eleven dollars and seventy eight cents. Now, per my calculations, it should have only taken off like eleven eighteen um, or eleven oh eight, something like that. Anyway, it took off like sixty or seventy cents more than what I calculated. But hey, that's good. Um, and so that brought my subtotal to a dollar forty-seven, which I did use twenty dollars worth of extra care bucks. It was a dollar forty-seven plus tax. With tax, it was three dollars and ninety-four cents, and I got back fifteen, ten, fifteen on this transaction. And I will get five back from the beauty club in a couple of days. So I really didn't lose anything. Um, just what I spent out of pocket, which was the three ninety-four with tax. Um, I was counting on this transaction being a five-dollar money maker because of the five dollars. Um, to make up for the seven that I lost this past Sunday, but I couldn't pass up the nails I just wanted to get those so but anyway, I didn't pay much out of pocket for it And if I went in and bought the nails, I would have spent eight dollars if I didn't have any coupons So I thought it was a good deal Anyway, um, I hope this was helpful and I hope you enjoyed it. If you're not already a subscriber, please subscribe. Hope you have a great day and God bless